Hi, today we talk about dropshipping. I'm Livella, top paid marketing consultant. Dropshipping is another way of earning. Okay, it is legal, it is licit. It means that you're basically an online merchant. So, for example, you buy a product for $40 and you resell it with $50 at $50. So you make $10 in this example. Dropshipping is based on buy generic customer products with a brand low ticket and reselling them thanks to a price difference, a tiny price difference. So this earning scheme works like this. You make a sale for $50 and then with the money you buy the product for $40. So in this example you make 10 and you will send it to real shopper. So, there is theoretically no out-of-pocket expense because of course that is. First, you sell for $50, you receive the money, you collect the money, and then you spend it. Yes, in theory, because of course there is an expense, of course. Before selling, <clears throat> you have to pay for the traffic. And the term traffic is, a, is something that I personally hate but in this particular video i'm taking the license to use it okay so basically what you do is you just go to alibaba and see what's trending right now and then you advertise it simply every month you change the product you're selling so nothing is ever built because every 30 days, you came back to zero, to scratch. You have to start all over again, okay? So the goal of, of this, the goal of it is to quickly scale this campaign and make some money. This has a huge margin problems because there, the margins are very, very low. The first time, for the first times, nothing is gained because you have to keep making money, reinvesting, making money, investing, giving the low margins. So at first, the claim is very, very slow because you make $50, you invest $50, you make $55, you reinvest, you make $61, you reinvest, you make $66, you reinvest, you make $72. It's very, very slow. It takes a lot of time. If you start with a small budget, for example, two thousand dollars, it will take years for you to make money. Period. Another great truth is that all drop shippers campaigns on the same products. One month is the month of torches. The other one is the month of uh, camping tents, and so on. Okay, everybody on the same things. Wait, I don't want to be misunderstood. I don't, I'm not saying that it's not possible to make money with drop shipping, affiliate marketing, and print demand, and so on. It is possible, of course. But I do not recommend that. You can also make money by stealing from old ladies. Okay, I don't recommend that either. So your goal is to quickly scale the campaign fast in one month and make some money out of it, basically. But where do you find the money to scale this campaign fast? Well, you have to, you must have them. In reality, this method works so much better with large numbers, high volumes, okay? Another thing that nobody really talks about online, but okay. Dropshipping works with large volumes because it's not based on the margins, they are too low. And maybe in that month you have to spend 10k, 15k a day. Okay? What do you do if you don't have them? Explain to me, please. Another thing that you have to know is that you can't 
really built a company in one month because how you go about hiring a phone closer a customer service and everything then is in between for something that will only last a month the reality is that you can do it so you go back to zero every month you never build anything I already hear your compliance is not true I know a lot of people that made $30,000 a month with drop shipping okay fine it would be your responsibility to show me your real their real results of course because so many people show the screenshots of their gross revenue of their e-commerces the problem is that 70% of this is used to buy products 10% for shipments and the remaining 20% you have to take in account advertising expenses and taxes so you already understand that there's no much left I have a couple of European students who made a decent amount of money with drop shipping, nothing special. So, it is, is this a good way to get started in online business? In my opinion, it's not. Okay. Like the affiliate marketing example I was making. Because great Facebook technical skills are needed. And above all, it plants in your own mind this mentality of sending traffic on sales page, which is not good. And these people, drop shipper, do not understand that traffic is not traffic. There are people to whom um, a message must be given. And this message must be congruent in every step of the funnel and every communication you make. So forget about earning methods they don't work what I advise you to do instead is to build a business reality it can also be small you don't need don't have a company with 300 employees to make a lot of money believe me I am the living proof of that so in reality you can earn very well as a freelancer to 200k years you can do it yourself without having to hire anybody my digital marketing for baboon course will teach you how to structure your business in the startup phase okay to launch a company in the shortest possible time with the least possible capital you can have. The goal here will be to make your business profitable in the shortest possible time. If you think it can help you, unlocking your financial situation, get it. If you want to buy my course, I'll leave you the link in the description, you can find it. And if you want to start doing business in a serious way, buy. Otherwise, don't. To me, having 1k or more or less doesn't make a big difference to my lifestyle. So, for you, instead, it's very different. Having this course will make a big difference in your life. The difference between working as an employee, earning a joke and starting to make some profits online with your your own new company get this course see you next time